here we are guys we are out at battery park going to the water we haven't vlogged in about a minute we're gonna start vlogging our travels we started working on our instagram you can see we were at northeast maryland last week it was last week well it's on my instagram whatever that was it's some donuts and coffee and today we're at Old Newcastle Battery Park. It's pretty. You know what I don't like about the vlogging is when you don't have a camera, you can't flip it around to you in the middle of. We're traveling right now. She videotaped us in the car. It's actually really nice out. It's not that hot. Is, is Moira awake? Yeah. Okay, here's the water. No swimming or waiting. <laughs> and there's people swimming and waiting. <laughs> so there's no swimming or waiting, and then there's people in the water. You're going to pay me to put my feet in this water. Uh, yeah, there are. You cannot. People fish here. Hmm. I wouldn't recommend you eat any of the fish here. Uh, one time we fished here just for fun, and we got when we got that crazy eel. <gasps> There's a fire ant. Or wait, wait, what is this called? A cow. Where's it at? I can't see it on my camera. Oh my god! I don't know if my camera's picking it up. There's two of them. Okay, I'm out of here. There's fire ants. Cow, cow, fire ants. I don't care what they're called, but they kill cows. <laughs> Remember we had them down at St. George's that, a couple years ago. Was that two years ago now? Three years ago? Yeah. It's actually beautiful. Beautiful day. Emily's getting her belly button pierced today. I think we're gonna vlog that somewhere. So what are these birds doing? We got down a little further and the birds are acting. They all just ran or flew or that's crazy. Oh yeah, maybe. I don't know what happened. Those came out. Lost down a little bit. Vlogging a little bit and then stopping. Yeah. Because I don't like all big vlogs of just walking. Nobody else wants to see that. Nothing really interesting. We found a little town. This is the little streets of Old Newcastle. Found the town. No, we didn't find it. It wasn't lost. Never We've never been here. No, we, we come here all the time. You know, I always want to come, though, when they have events. And let me tell you, I plan, like, oh, yeah. And the weekend they have an event, I don't feel like leaving my house. I don't know why. Just kind of, like, unsocial. Right? Yeah. I'm like, eh, I don't want to. I don't want to go around all those people. I don't know why. I always said, at Christmas one time we did the tree lighting. Yeah. I was kind of lame. It was really No lie. Which one? The, the old one? Newcastle tree lane they did. Oh, yeah, yeah. It was a little tree. I mean, this is such a bush. cute town. Like, you literally could, if people actually carried around here, it would look, it would, could be cute. Yeah. Here's like a little monument. Who's this? The uh, William Marco. I am place of William. William. Yeah. You can come see that. Super cute street, though, isn't it? Got some of the old rocks on the street. Cobblestone. They took out all the other cobblestone. Right? I haven't been over there, but I think they covered it. There's a whole street up here that was all cobblestone. And I'm pretty yeah, the sure they took one. it out. Oh, did they? I thought they went over it. it kind of looks like uh, Williamsburg, doesn't yeah. it? Even yeah. in Williamsburg, they took out all the cobblestone. Yeah, it's, I mean, it's a colonial town. 
Just to give an example, if anyone wants to come visit Old Newcastle while you're in Delaware. Yeah, and you can visit a couple of the houses. Yeah, um, the same, the Old Newcastle date. What is it called? You can actually buy tickets and you can go tour all the houses. Yeah, so they have the Dutch house. They have the uh, Old Sweet house, the Old Sweet church, the Caesar Rodney's house. Jessup's Tavern, that's a popular eating location. Yeah. I've been there once, but it's okay. And it's ice cream. And then they have the hand of ice cream yeah. Emily's craving right now. I guess we're going there. I guess we're going there. There is also, what is that, Nora Lee's? What is that? Louisiana food or New Orleans food? I said Louisiana. Yeah. Just cross the street without caring. What kind of ice cream are we going to get? We have a list. Oh, no. oh, that's really we, it's a, it's, a, it's the ugly it. selfie that's half the fun of it. reaction. She hates being on her vlog. It's good. It tastes good. She got the Dutch chocolate. Hello. Oh look! We have uh, new pictures there at the Coca-Cola sign. Oh yeah. Yeah. Emily did a little fashion shoot here. Oh yeah! If you ever go look at Emily's Instagram. Or don't. Anyway, that's where we had a dog. We did a whole photo shoot down here in fall. Oh! Yeah, Woodside Creamery is a local creamery that's Really good. We used to love going, have fun going there when the kids were young. Here's the New Orleans. They got the French Quarter Bistro. Super yummy I mean, Cajun food. We, we never eat this one, right? No, I've never been here. No, the one we went was in town. Remember, it was like they had Zatarain's Yes, box, it was so, so good. Was, bad. I said, it was I said good by accident. And we never went back. Yeah, I didn't like it. It was like a box of squishy rice. Yeah. It had no flavor. It was horrible. Should we walk? Let's walk up here for a minute. You want to go to the, the Terry House bed and breakfast? It's so cute though, it really is like a cute little town. <coughs> Are you trying to take a picture? Got the antique store. We went in here once, didn't we? What else they got? More antique. What's those? Oh, cocktails, happy hour. Oh uh, yeah. They used to be the like the coffee place, right? It used to be the pen, yeah. Yep. How much time do we have? This, what's this building here? Is it like a courthouse or what? It's a courthouse. Courthouse? I think, oh yeah, and they also do reenactments here. Like, I think Rob said that already. So, like, during their Old Newcastle days, or whatever they call them. Yeah, separation. Separation. That's it, right? Day. And then at night, they have fireworks. Like, I mean, we used to love coming, but like I said, the traffic gets ridiculous out of here. Oh, and we live five minutes from here, so now, <laughs> when the kids were younger and we didn't live five minutes, I think we were like 15, but still, we used to come more. I don't know as i've gotten older i don't like large crowds no traffic i think it was the COVID that really stopped me from really wanting to be around people because i had those two years where you couldn't go anywhere and then when we were around people i was just like this is annoying who even wants to do this stuff but i think you can also come down and buy a pass to look at some of the houses can't you like on different days i don't think it has to be a special day but isn't this the oh wait, what was this oh Sheriff House and County Jail. I didn't know that. Did you know? Did you know this was the jail? Mm -hmm. I didn't know that. There's a cemetery over here, which is actually really pretty. 
There's an archaeologist monitor on site. What did they find? Something? Hmm. I don't know what that means. They digging. There's a tent. There's a tent in there. They're digging for stuff. This is a really pretty walk over to. Oh, can we walk over to the cemetery? This is the Newcastle Visitor Center. If you want to come, this is I think where you would come buy your tickets so that you can see inside the homes. Like I said, I've never done it. Have we did it? Done it? No, I don't think so. Okay, maybe one day we will actually come to the old Newcastle Day and go inside. Yeah, we're gonna go to the cemetery. I mean, I think it'd be super cute if you lived here. You would feel like you lived in an old colonial town if yeah. you like that. I'd like to help, like, restore the wall of the cemetery. I don't well, know why. They look cool, though. Like, I feel like I want to fix things, but but keep it the same. Like, you gotta use the same material. Like, like across the street. That's the grass. There's no like, pathway. Rob won't even fix our uh, trim? trim in our trim. house, but he wants to go fix the cemetery wall in Newcastle. I didn't say I was like going to do it. <laughs> I'm here now. I feel like the same way when I walk past Like he's a cementer. You work with cement? Yeah, I could do it. Uh -huh. do anything. I'm mind here is the... Are we even allowed back here? Yeah. It's a cemetery. Everyone's allowed back here. What in memory of Dorothy? Wait, people have been buried here? Yeah, yeah, it's a real person. Yeah, there's people from like the well, 1800s. 1789. Yeah. Like cemeteries. Look, they're right there. Where? Right there. That's up. Oh, they're in, yeah, they're above the ground. How they're come they're ground. above ground? Like this one. Move that top and there's a person right there. Well, bones. They're bones. Yeah. We're walking right on top of them right now. This Look, one died in 1994. Oh, and then 2020. And their children, Elizabeth Guthrie, William Henry. All together? Henry. Yeah. They're all, all the mom and the three kids. Oh. Wow. I wonder how that happened. Oh. Well, these... 2020. I know, that's what I was saying. Huh. They actually just, just used their there. lot because they had it since 1916, though. Yeah. The whole family. Yeah, they stack them. Do they really? Yeah. Wow. Oh. Wow, this is kind of a newer headstone. I don't know what that was. Sorry, guys, you're looking at the ground because I probably walked through a spider web. Oh. This newer headstone, but August 30th, 1889. So maybe it didn't have something yeah. or it got ruined when they put a new one. Yeah, because even look, the top is cracked. But there's no way this was made in 1889. Yeah. You think? Really? This this is like uh, you know granite-like stuff. Yeah, maybe they had it redone. I wonder if they did. Like, I wonder if this was the original. Oh, yeah, and they went and around they it. Took it and redid it. Mm. Like, ground it down. Something. Yeah, maybe. Because even look how old this looks. Well, yeah. maybe not. I don't know. Wow. Super crazy. Let's see. Yeah, because I got this fancy one over here at the garden. So now look, that's a, a mausoleum thing. Oh yeah, this one is William R. King. He died. He was born to seven tenth, eighteen sixty three, and died. Wow, he didn't live long. Eighteen ninety four. Yeah, eleven years old. What? Right. Eighty three to ninety four. Oh, is that a six or an eight though? Eighteen eighty three uh, or eighteen sixty. No, it's eighty three. Oh, he was little. Yeah. What was his wife of uh, William? Uh -huh. I'm so confused. Is this a little girl? This girl is four years old when she died. Yeah. The this person was 91. That was in 1752. It's very interesting. She, she outlived her husband by 27 years. 
I mean, aren't these kind of interesting to you, though? The fact that people... I think so. Emily she said, at? nope, I don't even want to. <laughs> Emily, you don't like those? I used to love coming to. I used to love just hanging out in graveyards. We lived really close to one, and we would go over there sometimes at out? night. Yeah, at night, just to freak ourselves out. This one's got a big door on it. Yeah. Is that actually... Uh, it says receiving vault. Okay, that's uh, probably so where they goes, got the people. This goes into there, yeah. You'd open it up and... The cemetery people, like the... Yeah. Morgue. Like a morgue. That, that, why does that look like it's coming off? Where? He's leaning. Is it over there, too? No, that's the receiving vault where they do it. You put the people down into underneath the church. And then the red oh, sounds back. like a cracking. I want it like glued together. Oh, yeah. how about these little teeny tiny ones? They don't even. They just get a little thing that no one can read anymore. Yeah, somebody was there. That's right. The vines over there are pretty. Oh, look at that one. It's like leaning totally. <laughs> Couldn't you like buy like? If, if you Here we go. Exiting. Well, I mean, I guess you could if you really want to. You know how much headstones are. A lot. Really? Yeah. Oh. Nowadays, they're like 30 grand. For a headstone? Oh, they do still have cobblestone on this road. Yeah. Yeah, this is the last one. I thought they were redoing it, though. No, not, as far as I know, not this one. They were oh. going to leave this one intact. Okay. All the rest of them, they've done. Okay. Let's walk up the last bit, and then we are going to end it. Let's watch our last walk up. Well, we'll be back when we go watch Emily get her belly button ring. Yeah, it's 2.50. All right, we're going to walk back to the car.